vernier calipers. Keep the jaws of the vernier calipers closed. Observe the zero mark of the main scale. It must perfectly coincide with that of the vernier scale. If this is not so, account for zero error for all observations to be made while using the instrument. When the two jaws of the vernier calipers touch each other, both zero marks of the main scale and on the vernier scale should coincide. Here in the figure given, you see here, with the jaws closed, that is what a properly zeroed vernier caliper should look like. If not, there is a zero error in the vernier calipers. Positive zero error. If the zeroth division of the vernier scale is to the right of the zeroth division of the main scale, when the two jaws are brought in contact with each other, the error is said to be positive and the correction is negative. If small nth division of the vernier scale coincides with the sum division on the main scale, then zero error is equal to plus small n into least count. Here in the figure, you can see the case. Next, we have negative zero error. If the zeroth division of the vernier scale is to the left of the zeroth division of the main scale, the error is said to be negative and the correction is positive. If the small nth division of the vernier scale coincides with the sum division on the main scale, then zero error is equal to minus of capital N minus small n into least count, where capital N is total number of vernier scale divisions. You can see that in the figure given. Now the true reading is equal to observed reading minus of zero error with the sign. Here we see an example. If the two jaws touch each other, but the zero mark of the main scale and vernier scale do not coincide as given, the zero error is said to be positive. Here, the first division of the vernier is coinciding with the main scale. Now, zero error is 1 into least count, that is 1 into 0 0.01, it is equal to plus 0 0.01 centimeters. Suppose the observed reading is 3.1. 24 centimeters, then the correct reading is equal to absolute reading minus zero error with a sign that is equal to 3.24 minus of plus 0 0.01. It comes as 3.23 centimeters. Now, now we are taking the next example. If the two jaws touch each other, but the zero marks of the main scale and the vernier scale do not coincide as shown below. The zero error is said to be negative. Here, eighth line is coinciding. The eighth line of the vernier is coinciding with the main scale. Therefore, zero error is minus of 10, that is total number of vernier scale divisions, minus 8, that is coincidence reading, into least count, that is 0 0.01. It comes as minus 0 0.02 centimeters. Supposing the absorbed reading is 4.03 centimeters, then the corrected reading is equal to absorbed reading minus zero error. That is equal to 4.03 minus of minus 0.02 is equal to 4.05 centimeters.